Hey guys, it's Nina Simone, Nina Benz, Nina. That. I want it, I got it. 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 So I know this is way overdue. But I'm finally going to start posting videos on my YouTube channel. Yeah, I've been saying I'm going to post them all the time, but I never post one. So I'm actually going to start. Um, and so for my first video, I asked my followers on Instagram to ask me questions to do a Q&A. Um, so let's get started. Okay, so first question, where are you from? I'm from Long Island, New York, but... My family's bi-coastal, and I moved to L.A. when I was nine, so I go back and forth between L.A. and New York. Two, how old are you? I am 18, and I will be 19 on August 8th. What's your favorite sport? I don't play sports. I used to play sports, like, growing up, but, like, I'm not athletic whatsoever. So when I tell people that, like, I used to play sports, they, like, they laugh at me because they're like, Nina, you're the most bougie, like, rudest person ever. Like, you never played sports. Like, yes, I did. But if I had to choose a sport, it would probably be basketball. Um, just because basketball is cute, you know. Um, <laughs> who are your top three favorite basketball players? I don't know. Hold on. My friend, Cherish. What's a good it's basketball? Kyrie Irving Carmelo is fine. Carmelo. Carmelo looks great. Um, um, Kobe? Right? Go <laughs> okay. And Jason Tatum. Jason Tatum. Maybe Steph Curry. Oh. Throw a little curry. Ooh. Um, next question. Are you a funny person? Yes, I'm very funny. But well, I don't want to be like cocky or anything, but like I think I'm funny. But a lot of people think I'm like really rude. And they're like, Nina, you're such a b I'm like, I'm really not. Like, I'm just I'm just real. So if being real is a bitch, then call me a bitch. Feel me? <laughs> How was life growing up with the famous dad? Um Life growing up with a famous dad wasn't really hard for me because my parents made sure that, like, everything was normal still, like, growing up. Um, like, I mean, people think I'm spoiled. Like, we got nice things, of course, because we were able to, but it was more like, it wasn't, like, overdone. Like, it was more like, get good grades and, like, you could get this. Not like, oh, just because you have money, like, you just could get whatever you want. Like, we always had to, like, work for what we had, like, do chores, you know? Like, it was still normal. Like, my life was normal, and it's still normal. But, I mean, I guess when I was younger, it was a lot different. Like, because, like, I didn't, like, really know my dad was, like, famous until I was probably, like, five or six when people would be like, oh, like, your dad is blah, 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 blah. And I'm, like, six years old, so, like, I'm not really understanding fully, like, what they're trying to say. But, like, for me, I just see him now, like, that I'm older, I just see him, as, like, like, as an entertainer. Like, I just see it as his job. Like, I don't know. It's just normal for me. Like, it's, like, it's all I know. So, for me, it's just, like, he's my dad. It's just normal. Um, did that make sense? What is your favorite movie? Um... I Love You Man is my favorite movie, hands down. That movie is the funniest shit ever. Do you have sisters or brothers? Yes, I have two sisters, Samaria and Italia. Then I have an older brother, Najee. I'm the baby of the family. Um, music inspiration, definitely my father, because, you know, like, just seeing him grow as an entertainer and also, like, just giving me tips about the music industry that, like, other people wouldn't really have. Like, it's just good to have, because... You know that that's like what is it called like it's just right there you know what i'm saying mm -hmm. like people like a lot of people have to like go find those tips or like experience it themselves so i'm just lucky that i have my dad to kind of like explain stuff to me and like prepare me for what i'm gonna get into because i want to be an entertainer as well what makeup brands do you use i don't really wear makeup like that but when i do i use anastasia brow dip i'm not even wearing makeup right now oh my god <laughs> it's fine i look cute whatever period okay um anastasia brow dip mm -hmm. and i use better than sex mascara gold deposit um highlighter i don't wear foundation and then i wear like fancy lip gloss Same but did you interrupt me while i was talking what's it like being a celebrity's daughter the good the bad and the ugly i mean i kind of just answered that the good is just you know like connections and like just getting tips and advice early 
Um, the bad would be having like fake people around you. That's something I've always had to deal with. So like personally, like I have friends, but like I don't like to really have like friends. Like I only have like a solid group of people that like I actually like share my business with. And even them, I'm very like picky and choosy like with who I tell my stuff to. Um, yeah, just because you know people like they like to jump into stuff for like the wrong reasons and like be around people just because of what they have. And I don't really like that. What are your favorite foods? Can you shut up? I love tacos. My favorite food though is Chinese food. Like I could eat that all the time. I love chicken fried rice and I love soy sauce. Like everything. I just love Chinese food. All right, chicken ostrich stir fry, right? Uh, chicken wing. Um, what are your favorite animals? I hate animals, but no, I don't like hate animals. But it's like my dogs are annoying. You know, I have a lizard. Which is really weird because like you would never think I had a lizard, but I have a lizard. I actually like I want a white tiger to guard my house. That sounds really annoying. Like shut up Nina, but like that's what I want. Like you can ask anybody. Like I really want a white tiger guarding my house. Like that would just be mad dope. Do you like superhero or scary movies? I love scary movies. My favorite kind of movies are scary. Do you know how to twerk? Are you joking? <laughs> Skincare for your beautiful effing skin. I used to use Clear Start, which is like the best face wash ever. But I, like recently, I've been using um, what is it called? Oh, Pharmacy, that they sell at Sephora. It's like, and it's like this honey face wash. I don't really remember the name of it, but it's like all natural honey that's like grown on a farm in like New Jersey, I think. And my skin has been looking great, as you can see. Relationships in today's society, um. I mean, a lot of times our generation is so stuck in like that, like I have to cheat on my girlfriend or I have to cheat on my boyfriend or like I can't be loyal in 2019, like yes you can. And I just feel like as long as you're in the relationship and you treat the partner right, like you're good. Otherwise, don't be in one. I mean, I don't have a problem with them. I think it just depends on each person because every... Every guy and every girl is different, so, you know. When are you going to drop some music? I have something coming soon, probably June. Um, but I'm not even going to spoil that. I'm going to let you guys wait. Favorite clothing store? I shop everywhere. A lot of high-end stores, but then also a lot of, like, I like, I like, like, Urban Outfitters also and, like, different stores like that. But I like to wear a lot of men's clothes, throw it together and make it kind of girly. Like, I wear a lot of, I mean, right now I'm wearing a bodysuit. Like, I look, like, really girly. But I like to just wear sweatpants or like cargo pants, baggy pants, like a like an oversized tee and sneakers. Next question: What are your favorite sneakers? Okay, um, my favorite sneakers right now are these. They're the newest addition to my closet. They're really pretty. I haven't named him yet, but you know I got shoelaces on the laces. A lot of y'all don't got that. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Um, nah, but these are off white times Nike, and you know. Yellow, like lime green and like neon yellow has been like the color recently. I said that mad weird. I meant the color recently, not however I just said it. But yeah, you know. Um, those are my favorite and I like Nike a lot. But I also like like uh, Balenciagas. Oh, I wear my runners, like my, my trainers all the time. The sock ones because they're just mad comfortable. I can wear them with anything. College life. I mean... I could stay out however later I want. I can do what I want. But for me particularly, like, I don't really like college. Like, I like I like being home with my family. I just, you know, like, I just like to be alone. And I like to be with my family and just be with my family. Because my sisters are my best friends. My brother's my best friend. My mom, I love my mom. I love my dad. Like, I just like being home. Do you wear wigs or bundles and frontals? I have no idea what you're talking about because this grew out of my head. So, next question. <laughs> Fashion inspiration. Kylie... Tiana Taylor, Kim K, my older sister Samaria, I'm sure you guys know her. I love how she dresses too. My mom is so fly. My mom is fly as hell. What made you want to pursue music? I don't know. My mom says that like I was humming since like before I could walk, like before I could speak. So I've just always loved to sing. I don't know. But yeah, like I've just always loved to sing and like dance. Anything I want to do is always creative. Like I'm never, I've never been into anything else that's like not music related. So... Can you do workout videos? I don't work out, but if I did, I would do them. My workout consists of me eating Chipotle and then walking back to my dorm, then walking back to Chipotle, eating the Chipotle, then working it off by walking home. Like, that's it. 
What planet would you travel to? I would never leave Earth. I'm just too scared. I don't like to be in tight spaces. Like, I could not be on a rocket ship. I can't be in tight spaces for, like, a long time. I would just... I would probably die because, like, I'm a really anxious person. Like, I have anxiety. I'm paranoid. Like, I'm always upset. Like, I'm scared of everything. Like, I just couldn't. Biggest pet peeves. I hate... Oh, my God. Well, I have misophonia, which is a sensitivity to sounds. I'm self-diagnosed. <laughs> My doctor didn't even have to tell me. I hate the sound of people breathing. I hate the sound of people chewing. I hate the sound of people doing anything. Like, if you do anything... Oh, swallowing drinks is the worst one. That's the worst one. Like, I hate when you could, like, hear the... Hear, like, inside the throat. Like, I really hate that. So any sound really, like, near me or in my space will really just take me out. That's my biggest pet peeve. Now, last question. Oh, this is such a good one. Are you single or are you taken? <laughs> thank you guys for watching my first video i hope you guys enjoyed it i will try to post another one next week i love you